In this video, we're going to have a look at the difference between using the verb try and then a verb in the ing, for example, I tried calling, or a verb, the verb try and then to do, for example, I tried to call. Typically, when you say that you try doing something, you are referring to the method you have used or you want to use to get another goal. For example, if somebody says, you're always late for work, maybe you should try getting up earlier, they are suggesting this method of avoiding being late for work. So this is not your objective. Your objective is to arrive on time for work. So this is one option, one method you can uh, you can use. If you say something like, she tried talking about it to Steve, but he wouldn't listen. So the objective is not to talk. The object talking is just a method. In this case, it didn't work. But the method of reaching the objective was talking. Or I tried calling you, but you wouldn't answer the phone. Again, the objective was to talk to you. The objective was not to call. This was the method use. If what you mean to express is the goal, your aim, your objective, then what you need to use is the verb in the infinitive after try. So for example, if I tell somebody, just try to stay calm. So this is what my main goal, my main objective could be. That's what I'm aiming for. Or I tried to open the window. This is what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to achieve, open the window. And I tried to do it. I tried to reach that objective. Or if I say, I'll try to call her again. So this is what I want to do. I want to call her. So this is what I will try to do. So I want to reach an objective, a goal. I'm aiming for something. Have a look at these two sentences. In the first one, the problem is I couldn't sleep. So to solve this problem, I tried this method. I tried counting sheep. In the second uh, sentence, this is what I wanted to do. This was my objective. And this was my intention. I tried to email you. And many times there is a problem, but the internet wasn't working. But this was my objective. This is what I wanted to do. Whereas in the first one, this is not what I wanted to do. I wanted to sleep. And this was the method I used to reach that objective. As you can see in the picture, this person's ankle is swollen because they've, they've had a fall or they've hit somebody or something, whatever. Okay, so I may say this in two different ways. I might say to this person, your ankle's swollen and then suggest Try applying ice, and that's the method I'm going to, or I'm suggesting. I could also say, try to reduce swelling. And this is what I want to get. This is my objective. Try to reduce swelling. And in this case, to reinforce the idea of methodology, you could use the preposition by, by applying ice. So, in this case, because I'm only using one sentence, I don't need the preposition. Try applying ice. In this case, because I've already used the infinitive, then it's better for me to use the preposition. But just for you to see the contrast, um, what you mean when you say try to reduce swelling or try applying ice. 